Hi everyone, Jason Lupke, Global Solutions Specialist with Houghton Mifflin Harcourt. We're going to talk now about the third grade into math teacher's edition planning and pacing guide. And so this is a teacher facing resource that comes with the program and it's, it's meant to be a supplement that goes with the teacher's guide. We know here that we're in grade three, it's right here on the front cover. You'll also see that on the back, I can see that it's also identified as grade three. Now, this thin, soft cover resource is really going to help guide you with implementation of the program. So whenever we talk with teachers about starting with Into Math, we really refer them to the planning and pacing guide to kind of help get you started. Let's dive right in. So the first thing that I wanted to talk about inside of the planning and pacing guide is just to take a nice overview look at the program uh, architecture and kind of what makes up our Into Math program. So you can see here, it's really built on three main pillars. And that is really good content architecture, surrounded by first in class teacher support. And then of course we use that assessment data and reports paired with that architecture and teacher support to really drive that student growth. You know, that continues when we start thinking about the content architecture inside of the program, one of the newest features for Into Math and something that, that I think is really at the heart of, of what makes Into Math um, apart from the other programs that are out there, that is the learning arc. And so we've taken the best research in how students learn math and what works for our instruction. And, and we've discovered that while we can do conceptual understanding, and we can work towards building that procedural fluency. What's often missing in a traditional math program is that piece between. You know, it's that bridging the, that conceptual to the procedural learning that gets us that, uh, that, that real deep understanding and helps to ensure that we have the procedural fluency that we're looking for. You know, we go deeper inside of the planning and pacing guide. So once you have your hands on that, you're able to take a look at at a little deeper what, what that really means. I wanted just to take a second to talk about two other advantages inside of our Into Math program that I think you'll really like. The first is the Spark Your Learning Task. And if you watch our Teacher's Edition and Student Edition videos in our unboxing series, you'll learn more about the Spark Your Learning Task. But just know this is an opportunity for students to really get inside of the math develop that productive perseverance that we're looking for in our students. And then also the talk moves. So we have talk moves, coaching cards that come with the program and really help you as the teacher in working with your students and developing the mathematical thinking that we're, that again, that we're working towards. Continuing with that content architecture, you know, we've embedded those mathematical practices and processes and so we give you some things to think about as teachers, some great questions to ask around each one of those processes and practices. And again, that's embedded into the content architecture of the program. And you know, something that as a math teacher, I came to understand and know really well is that math really is a second language for all of our students. And so we've made a point for Into Math of really digging into the language development skills. And so you're gonna see things like language routines and a focus on that key academic vocabulary around math. And we, that really starts here inside of the planning and pacing guide. Continuing on with that, you know, language development, some of the strategies that we use with our students, like the three reads, the compare and connect. And those are strategies that you see at every grade level and throughout the program. Moving on, you know, we talk about not just great content architecture, but that teacher support. So, you know, it's, it's great to know that that support is there for you. It's embedded inside of not only the teacher materials, but also the platform. And there's lots of other resources that we have to help support you as the teacher and to help support your students. So one of the things that's embedded in the program is that idea of fostering a learning mindset. And so we've had this unique partnership with Mindset Works in developing that mindset in our students. Of course, near the back, we get into the pacing guide portion of this planning and pacing guide. This is where you'll see the different types of lessons that are included throughout. 
okay? And those three different types of lessons that match the learning arc that we talked about. Remember, we have the bridging lessons that are going to connect those conceptual lessons to our procedural fluency lessons, which are here in the purple. So you'll notice three different types of lessons in the pacing guide. Um, additionally here, we see the, the standards that we're focusing on and the number of days that, that we expect that that might take. And then finally, as we move to the back of the planning and pacing guide, we have all of these anchor charts that are great for you to use with your students that will help us identify those strategies. These are printable from the platform. And again, also included right here in your planning and pacing guide. Okay, so this has been a conversation about the planning and pacing guide that goes with our Into Math program. Be sure to watch the rest of the videos in our series. Thank you for watching. Make sure to subscribe to the HMH International Content Cares YouTube channel. If you're looking for more content, click on the video to the right of your screen. Welcome to our global community.